Organic organisms detected. That's why I'm here. Game Trailers Game of the Year Awards 2013. While the bulk of media attention is being squarely aimed at the Xbox One and PlayStation 4, the PC cares little about the next-gen arena because, well, it doesn't have to. From juggernauts like StarCraft II Heart of the Swarm to bold independent titles like Gone Home and Anti-Chamber, the PC is providing the broadest lineup of any platform, spread across almost innumerable marketplaces. Stanley was so bad at following directions, it's incredible he wasn't fired years ago. Thanks to the ever-flexible Source Engine, the Stanley Parable takes assets from Half-Life 2, a first-person shooter, and creates an adventure that questions video game storytelling through limited interaction. The 2013 version simultaneously makes the game's message more focused and incomprehensible. But regardless of what you take away from the Stanley Parable, the writing keeps it entertaining for however long you decide to stick with its madness. Gunpoint also hosts a humorous script, spliced between plenty of clever puzzles. Set in a world of corporate espionage, Gunpoint allows you to easily slip into the role of a sleuthing freelance spy. Rewiring circuitry and getting the jump on bad guys is easy since there's not much cluttering up the scenery beyond what you can interact with. Your options for any situation are often numerous, allowing you to deduce solutions in your own way rather than forcing you to align with a single line of thought. This blend of simplicity and freedom makes Gunpoint easy to get into and hard to stop playing. The Swapper is also a mind-bender, putting you in a spacesuit rather than a trench coat. You can create up to four simultaneous clones and then use those doppelgangers to solve puzzles. The clones mimic your move. The clones mimic your movements, so for every step or jump, you have to account for how that will affect the clones. Additionally, you can swap your consciousness between the clones at any time, letting you choose the leader. As you experiment with solutions for the obstacles in each area, dozens of clones might perish as a result. Rather than have this simply be the consequence of progress, the swapper connects it to the story, giving the game existential heft. Drag your knuckles and get comfortable. Dota 2 is one of the best examples of how to do free-to-play right. Spending money is never more than a suggestion, and not for a single second do you feel like the game is trying to pry open your wallet. The game has more than 100 heroes, and each is available as soon as you click play. The number of available options can be a bit overwhelming, but a mixture of tutorials, bot matches, and a mode that limits hero selection makes Dota 2 surprisingly approachable. With more than 550 concurrent players on Steam each day, Valve has created one of the most vibrant multiplayer games in recent memory. And the winner is... While Indies had an undeniably strong showing taking up three of the nominees, no PC game captivated us this year like Dota 2. Entire weekends evaporated as we sank hundreds of hours into its competitive depths. Every hero almost feels like a new game as you endlessly try to figure out the best builds and playstyles for each. Above all, Valve has done an excellent job making it easy to become part of the community with its spectating options and inclusive tournaments. Dota 2 is strong, and we can't imagine what it'll be like in five years, but we know we'll still be playing. <laughs>